Right. Good morning, everybody, or rather good afternoon, everybody. It's half, half past four. Uh, so I think it's time for us to start. Uh, welcome to the College Awards Ceremony for the School of Agricultural, Earth and Environmental Sciences. Uh, this is always a great occasion and one that I really enjoy because we are honoring the top performing students for 2021 in the school. Who So welcome to all of you, welcome to your friends, welcome to your lecturers, welcome to your sponsors. Uh, you here because of your own hard work and good efforts. Uh, so I hope you enjoy the afternoon. Uh, just please keep yourselves on mute unless you are speaking um, so that we have no background noise and keep your videos off if you want to save data. Um, but otherwise, I'm sure you know how Zoom works. Uh, speaker view is the best view. So I think let's commence with the ceremony and I will hand over to the Dean and Head of School, um, Prof Fatou Mudal, who will officially open this evening and welcome you all. Uh, Prof, over to you. Thank you so, so much, Sari. Um, I'm, I'm trying to, oh yeah, I'm hoping that now you can see me. Uh, to the DPs of the college, uh, Prof Samari, the sponsors of the award and to the recipient of the awards, parents of the awardees, colleagues and leadership within the school, ladies and gentlemen, good evening, San Juan. As a school, we are so ecstatic about the awards you will be receiving tonight. And it's so much deep thoughts of what I should share with you tonight. Having look in both intrinsic and intrinsic position, we find ourselves in and around UKZN today. Getting an award is the happiest moment of any recipient. I had a deep thought of what the, about the topic that I, I would like to share with you tonight. And I came across from this from UKZN strategic mission. University of Choice. Our mission as a university, a truly South African university of choice that is academically excellent, innovative in research, entrepreneur, and critically engaged within society. Now, what is the meaning of, of my choice? And what is the meaning of your choice tonight? of one choice as chosen or desired by oneself among all the options. And what is the meaning of the freedom of choice? And the freedom of choice describes an individual opportunity and autonomy to perform an action selected from at least one available or two of available options, unconstrained by externalities. Now I've got two big questions that I want to ask you about this choice. What, is, what does it mean to make a choice? And why did you choose us? How you live after attaining this award is your choice. And society is going to judge you of what you have attained, attained tonight. And you're gonna have challenges either in your communities, in your society, a school and whatever way you are. And what you choose is your choice. Your parents sent, us, sent you to us to look after you as their choice. And also the, to a parent to lead you and to show you a better way of your life. Hence, we have given you the opportunity to parent you in order to get this award today. Other parents might not have sent you here either by choice or perhaps it could have been because of the proximity of UKZN. You achieved this award as a choice of hard work and which we truly appreciate that. And we are so proud of you. You might have made so many mistakes, which sometimes was not your choice. But as a school leadership, as a college leadership, as a university, we chose to forgive those who had missed, mistake, made a mistake as a choice. And to make a choice, people decide of the two or more possibilities or alternative, which one is the best. 
and people make choices every moment about their every thoughts, feeling, and action. Often these choices are made very quickly and below a person level of consciousness and awareness. In the last year, I was, I spoke about inspiring great greatness. And this year I'm talking about as a university of choice, which you decided to choose us willingly. And I would like to challenge you tonight, each of you who will be receiving these awards, go and exemplify the choice and the UK Zetan brand in your career, society, community, to also make your parents proud of what you achieved tonight. As a dean and head of school, I would like to congratulate you all the recipients of these awards. You made us proud and you made your choice diligently to work so efficiently. And we are so proud of you once again. You made a good choice to be at UK Z10. And as I conclude this short speech, this is the university of choice indeed. And I thank you so much and I congratulate you. Go and enjoy the best of what you, could, what you have chosen and we really indeed appreciate it. And I thank you very much, sir. I now hand over to you. Thanks very much, Prof, for those words. Uh, we'll now go straight into the award ceremony. Uh, how it will work is that I am going to share my screen where I have the awards. Um, and I'm going to call on Prof. Lembe Maguaza, who is the academic leader for teaching and learning, to read out the awards. And what he will do, he'll read out the name of the award and um, the recipient of the award. And then he will give you a chance to turn on your mic, turn on your video, and just say a few words if you would like to. If you are camera shy, no pressure, but we would really like to hear from you. And then if any of the sponsors are here, I know we have some of them with us, if they would like to say a few words as well, um, they would be welcome to. So I think with no further ado, uh, Lembe, I'm going to hand over to you and to read out the awards. Okay, thank you, Sally. And uh, good afternoon, uh, uh, our deans, and also good afternoon to colleagues and everyone in attendance, including uh, parents, sponsors, and everyone who is here. Um, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, I'd like to uh, present the first uh, award of the evening, which is the DT, DMT Kaibata Award for Best Honor Student in Geological Sciences, which is presented to Peter Fermuren. I don't know if Peter is here to accept the award or also if, yes, Hello, Peter, yes, please go ahead. <laughs> Uh, I would firstly like to thank UKZN for giving me this award. It is such an immense honor and I'm beyond grateful. I would also like to thank my family and loved ones for all their support, especially my mom and dad, for everything that they have sacrificed for me to be where I am today, as well as thank you to Yuri Ramruthan for all her love and support. Uh, a special thank you to Dr. Hasty for all his support and guidance throughout my honors degree. And to all the lecturers and staff of the geology department, I say thank you. Last but not least, I would like to say thank you to the NRF for funding my honors degree and making it all possible. Thank you. Thank you, Peter. Okay. Yes, next one, um, Sally, thank you. Uh, the next one is an award called Albert T. Modi Ubuntu Award for Outstanding Inter, Multi and Transdisciplinary Masters Research, which is uh, awarded to Kiara Brewer. Kiara, over to you, ma'am. Good evening, everyone. I'd just like to express my gratitude and thanks for this award. My master's research has really caught a lot by storm and it's really made uh, impact in a lot of communities in agricultural and technological research. So I'd just like to say a big thank you to my supervisors who are Prof. Tafazo Mbaudi, Prof. Alistair Klulo, and Dr. 
um, Mbulisi Sibanda. I'd like to thank the entire WRC team as well as the NRA for funding my master's research. And congrats to all the other awardees. Thank you, Kiara. Uh, Sally, if we can move to the next yeah. one. Uh, Lembe Prof Modi yes. is here, uh, the sponsor of the award. I'm not sure if you okay, want to yes. say a few words. Okay. Good afternoon, colleagues. Um, thank you very much for the opportunity to say a few words. Uh, Kira, well done. Um, it's not an easy thing to be recognized for a multidisciplinary performance. Clearly, your study shows that uh, you have a future. Uh, the world requires people who've got multi-purpose skills. I thank the school for continuing to give this award to our best students. And uh, I wish to emphasize that we will continue to make this award available. Please be a model and example to the students who are coming behind you. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Thank you, Kiara and Prof Modi uh, for, for that uh, nice presentation. Um, the next award or the next award is an award called uh, Joseph Baines Estate Award for Agricultural Economics. Sorry, sorry, for Agricultural and Environmental Science Innovation, which is presented to Pure Ocean Logo. Pure Ocean, are you here? Would you like to say something? Uh, yes, I'm here, Prof. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Um, just to give thanks for this award. I'd like to first to thank the College of Agriculture, Engineering and Science for hosting these awards. Um, I'd like to also thank my supervisor, Professor Joyce Chicha for uh, outstanding supervision and mentorship throughout the research, as well as my uh, academic journey. Uh, I'd like to thank the sponsors of the award that I'm receiving, the Joseph Baines um, Estate. Um, last but not least, I'd like to thank me for uh, believing in myself and not giving up um, in times of struggle and hardships. Um, yeah, thank you to all who are, who are here, who are present, and uh, good luck to the future uh, candidates for 2023 who might receive these awards. Thank you very much. Thank you. Um, Sally, do you have a, a sponsor for this yeah, one? Um, Prof. Yes. Modi is there as a representative of okay. the staff. Thanks again, colleagues. Pure, um, I would like to uh, say this on behalf of the Board of Trustees of the Bainsfield Estates. I informed them about this uh, development last week when we had our meeting. Uh, they agreed to sponsor the university using this award a couple of years ago. And uh, they said that uh, I must convey my thanks to the university for continuing uh, to give uh, deserving students this recognition. And uh, uh, it is part of what uh, uh, is a philanthropy in the jo Joseph Baines uh, estate um, where they assist many needy students as well as uh, mainly the members of the general population Hopefully one day you will go to Bainsfield Estate and see the wonderful place and they will assist you in the right directions uh, as far as the future direction uh, of careers in agriculture. Well done. Thank you, Prof. Modi. Thank you, Prof. And, and also thank you to Pio. It's very rare where someone remembers to thank themselves. We always humble ourselves so much that we just want to thank everyone else except ourselves. So uh, that was a very good pure. Thank you. Okay, Sally, if we can move forward. Okay. Um, the next award is a Rich Quebec Award for the best second year plant pathology 214 student, which goes to Mobile Pengu. Mobile, are you here to say a few words before we move forward? Uh, I'd like to thank the sponsor of the of these awards, the lecturers, and the College of Agriculture for inspiring us. And would also like to thank my family 
for the support and give the credit to myself for always working hard and not giving up on my studies. And I'd like to say congratulations to everyone who won. Thank you. Part of these awards. Thank you. Okay, thank you, Mobile. Okay, um, the next award is also um, by the same sponsor, which is Richard Beck uh, Award for best second year plant pathology 214 students. So, uh, which goes to uh, happiness in the loop. Happiness, um, are you I here? I don't see her here, Lembe. Um, okay, no, it's um, fine. We'll, we'll reserve a space for her if she arrives late. She might have connectivity problems, so it's fine. We can move forward. If she arrives, we can, uh, maybe Dogozo can just keep an eye for us. Thank you. Okay. I think we skipped one. Yes, there we go. Thank you. Uh, the next award is uh, by uh, Lima Grain Zad South Africa Annual Plant Pathology Award for the best third year pathology or plant pathology student with the highest combined mark for plant pathology. And the award goes to Sanel C. Wembuto. Is Ms. Muto in? Yes, yes, I'm here. Okay, go ahead, Ms. Muto. Good afternoon. Um, I'm honored to receive this award and I'd like to thank my family and friends for their support. It was not an easy journey, but I managed to pull through. Um, thank you so much. Thank you, Sanel Siwe. Sally, do you have a sponsor? Uh, no, I don't think a sponsor is here for this one. Okay, cool. So moving forward, uh, we're looking at uh, another award by PSYCOP, which is called PSYCOP Award for best third year plant pathology student with the highest mark for plant pathology 370. And the award is also going to Sanel Siwembu too. Uh, thank Sanel you so Siwe, much. I don't know if you want to say something again. Uh, uh, thank you so much. Yeah, I just want to say that. <laughs> Now, congratulations. Thank you. Okay, so the next award is um, by Ingaba Biotech, which is called Ingaba Biotech Award for the best third year virology student in the module Introduction to Viruses, which is Plant Pathology 305. And the award is given to Mtobi C. Mazibubo. Toby, see, are you here to accept the award? I'm not seeing his name, Linda. Okay, so Toby is the second one. If and Togozo can also keep an eye from Toby C. Okay, we can move to the next one. <laughs> okay, so the next award is Funder Plank Award for best pathology honor student with the highest combined mark for plant pathology 750 and plant pathology 785. And the award is given to Sipesile Faya. Sipesile, are you here to accept the award? He is here. Okay, let's wait. Especially if you're camera shy, you can switch off your, your, your camera, but we would like to hear just a few words from you of acceptance. Okay, it doesn't seem, doesn't seem like, carry on. yeah, he wants to say any, something. Okay, cool. So we'll move to the next award, which is um, MSc Crop Science Award for top crop science postgraduate student. And the award is going to Mobile Nkomo. Mobile, are you here? Yes, I'm here. Please accept the award, ma'am. I accept. <laughs> 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 I just want to thank the sponsors of the award and also 
a special thanks to my supervisors, Prof. Dindo and Dr. Roland. I would also want to thank my family and my friends. It was not an easy journey at all, at all. And I actually still try to ask myself how I came here, but I'm truly grateful. Thank you and congratulations, Mavile. Um, um, we don't have the sponsor selling, okay? So the next award is uh, presented or is sponsored by Lima Rural Development Foundation, which is called Lima Food Security Award for top student in postgraduate diploma in food security. And the award is presented to Sibonelo Mtobisi Sitole. Mtobisi, are you here to accept the award? And I'm aware that also the sponsor is here. Hello, hi, evening. Yes, I'm here, uh, I'm here, Prof. Uh, yes, go ahead, Tobias. Uh, I am very honored uh, to receive the, the Lima Rural Development Food Security Award for being the top student uh, in the postgraduate diploma for the year 2021. Uh, to be honest, uh, this, is, this is among the most important event of my student career. And I will always recognize this day and I will recognize it with honor and with love. And it shows my dedication and my hard work. Uh, moreover, I, I'm also looking forward to where I will also perhaps have a chance where I will also get a chance to work with the Lima Rural Development Foundation. Uh, most important, I'll also like to thank lectures from the food security department. And more special, I would love to thank uh, my supervisor, Dr. Dan Van Nijew. Uh, with whom is also present today. Yes, but all in all, thank you very much. Thank you, Mtobisi. And I see the, the sponsor um, present, uh, represented here by uh, Duncan. Congratulations, Ponelos. Pity we're not together where I could shake your hand and give you the award, but well done. Congratulations, nasty, done. Thank you. Thank you, Duncan. Okay, so moving forward, uh, the next award is sponsored by Campbell Scientific, uh, which is called a Campbell Scientific Agro Meteorology Floating Trophy uh, for best student having completed Agro Meteorology 210 and Agro Meteorology 212 within the same year. And the award goes to Zola Samantha Jama. Is Zola here to accept or to give us a word of thanks for the award? Yes, Prof. Um, I'd like to thank myself for working hard and also thank Dr. Gloria for always giving guidance and also thank my friends and family for always supporting me. Thank you. Thank you. Do you have a campus scientific? No? Okay, cool. Thank you. Okay, so the next award is... Um, Ronald Schulz Award for top 30 year hydrology student proceeding with hydrology honors. And the award goes to Amira Jacob. Amira, are you here to give a few words of um, thank for this award? Yes, I'm truly so honored to be receiving this award this afternoon. I would like to take this moment to thank both my parents for being a huge support during my journey and all of the outstanding lecturers in the hydrology department. I'm so grateful for the entire journey and having been afforded this recognition. Thank you. Thank you, Amira. And we're moving to the next award and I'm convinced looking at the sponsor here that this might come with the a lump sum of money. <laughs> the award goes, sorry, the, the award is sponsored by Standard Bank and the award is called the Standard Bank Agricultural Economics Award for the student with the best combined average marks for agricultural economics 220 and 270. And the award is given to Tabo Morobi. Tabo, are you here to accept and also say a few words? In acceptance yes, of the award. Yes, go ahead. Uh, I would like to thank uh, you, Kazetan, for giving me the opportunity to study here. Uh, they really made a good choice. Um, I also like to thank my family and my friends. They are here, and also um, lectures from Department of Agricultural Economics. 
um, and also my family. Thank you. And also Tunnel Bank. Thank you. I really appreciate the work. Okay. Thank you, Tabo. Okay. The next award is the HI uh, Beram Award for the best student in Agricultural Economics 791 and Agribusiness 791 or Agricultural Management 790. And the award is given to Mzolisi Kusi. Mzolisi, are you here to accept the award or say a few words in acceptance? He is here. He might be a bit shy. Okay. Give him a chance maybe to rethink Zolisi. This is the best opportunity for you to, to shine. Please don't be shy. Okay. No, it's fine, Sally. I think we can go ahead. We'll give him a chance if he changes his mind. Okay, uh, the next award is also by uh, Lima Rural Development Foundation, and it is called Lima Rural Development Award for the best student in agricultural economics 380. And the award is presented to Ntoko Zobutelezi. Shenge, are you here? Uh, hello, Prof. Thank you for the, for the opportunity. Um, greetings to everyone who's present here. I'd like to thank um, you guys at end with the opportunity to be a student and a valuable resource uh, to the society. Um, and uh, thanks to Lima Rural Development with the recognition of my good work. Um, thank you, Prof. Overton. Thank you. And uh, I remember, I recall we have uh, Duncan Stewart. Yeah. Just to congratulate um, Bob Shange, well done. Um, Top of 380, my favorite course. That's why that's why we sponsor it. Yeah. Good. Thank you, Duncan. Yeah, thank you. Well done. Okay, moving forward. Um, the next award is by Citrus Growers Association, which is called Citrus Growers Association Floating Trophy for the best fourth year agricultural economic student. And the award is presented to Bandile Bengsuayo. Bandile, are you here? Yes, Pat. Yes, I would like to thank the Citrus Growers Association for the, for the award. I'm really honored. And I would like to give my utmost thanks to all the lecturers in the Department of Agricultural Economics for their assistance and guidance throughout the years. Thank you. Thank you. Sally, anyone from Citrus Growers? Yes, we've, we've got two people, Paul and um, Justin. I'm not sure who wants to say, say a few words. Good evening, everybody. It's Paul Hardman here. Um, congratulations, uh, Bandile, for winning the award. Well done for your hard work. Um, and uh, it's a really excellent course that you, you've you chosen as well. And uh, keep going. And uh, congratulations to to the other students as well. It's been, been a wonderful achievement here. Thank you. Thank you very much, Paul. And we appreciate your sponsorship. Uh, we're going to move forward. And I see it's the same name and the award is called Agricultural Economics Association of South Africa uh, for the best student in all agricultural economics and agribusiness module. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to repeat this. This is Agricultural Economics Association of South Africa award. And it goes to the student that best performed in all agricultural economics and agribusiness module. And this award is going to Bandi Le Pegiswayo. Bandi Le, do you want to say something more? Please. I'd like to thank the Agricultural Economics Association for the recognition. I am very honored. Thank you. Thank you. Anyone from the association? Uh, no, that's fine. Okay, cool. So the next one is uh, by Wazulu Natal Poultry Institute, which is a book award for best student in animal science 201. And the award is, so yes, the award is presented to Jasmine Morgan. Jasmine, 
Congratulations, and would you like to say um, a word of thanks for the award? I'm really honored to be receiving this award, and I'd like to thank Dr. Nikki Tyler for all her efforts in Animal Science 201 and for the KCMPI for their sponsorship. And I also like to thank my family and friends and Hexagon Trust for their continuous support. And mostly, I'd like to thank Jesus because without him, nothing is possible. Thank you, Jasmine. And I'm aware that the sponsors are also here. Is Nikki, Nikki Tyler's here? Yes, Nikki, please go ahead. Oh, sorry, I'm trying to put my video on here. Yeah. Um, hi, Jasmine, congratulations as your lecturer of this module, but I'm also here on behalf of KZNPI. They wanted me to extend their congratulations to you. It was a hard fought um, prize. I think there was less than 1% difference in the top students. So well done to you. Thank you, Nikki. Okay, so the next uh, award is called a South African Society of Animal Science Award for the best ye final year student in animal science. And the award is presented to Kulagase David Chesi. Over to you, Zaba, are you here to accept the award? Yes, yes, I'm here, Prof. Uh, first of all, I'd like to thank God I believe that my academic career has been so hard, but through the grace, I've been able to pull through. And uh, I'd like to thank the whole animal science department, the lecturers, they've been so patient with me. I've made a lot of mistakes in my career, but you know, as Prof said earlier on, they forgave me. And yeah, thank you very much for your patience. And uh, I'd also love to thank the South African Society of Animal Science this is a very big recognition, especially from such a big organization. Uh, I would also like to avail myself uh, as someone who is also willing to work with the organization if anything comes up, projects and stuff like that. Um, and I believe that uh, I still need a bit of work here and there because I, I want to be an experienced animal science animal scientist. Thank you very much. Thank you, Lava. Uh, Sally, do we have a sponsor to say a few words before we move to the next? Uh, yes, Nikki is representing them. Okay, Nikki. Kulakatle, well done. You've really been an exceptional student with excellent marks. And on behalf of SASAS, the South African Society for Animal Science, I wish to extend congratulations. Thank you once again, Nikki. And moving forward, ladies and gentlemen, um, we're moving to the next award, which is sponsored by KwaZulu Natal Agricultural Union, which is called Guanalu Floating Trophy for the top Bachelor of Agriculture undergraduate student, which is presented to Bongi Tobela. Bongi, are you here to accept the award? Yes, Prof, I'm here. Okay, go ahead. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank uh, the University of Basel Natal for giving me this opportunity. It is a very big honor for me to get this award. Um, I would like to thank um, all the lecturers, and most of all, most importantly, I would like to thank my mom for supporting me in every step of the way. But importantly, uh, I'd like to thank myself for not giving up, uh, for putting uh, too much effort um, uh, on my studies and everything. And I would like to thank uh, Guanal for sponsoring this award. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Bongi. Is anyone representing Guanal? Okay, we can move forward. Okay, um, this one is the Discipline of Dietetics Award for the best final year dietetics student. And it goes to Tulani Sikakane. Tulani, if you can accept and also say a few words of thanks for the award. Yes, good afternoon to everyone. So it's first year dietetics student. Uh, sorry about that, Prof. So I would like to uh, thank uh, the lecturers for, for being with us in this journey. And I would also like to thank the university 
recognizing our hard work and I would like to just say, uh, I hope to be here uh, next year. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Tulani. Okay, so the next award is Harley Scott or Rossell Floating Trophy, Trophy for the best second year dietetics student, which goes to Courtney Nunes. Courtney. Thank, thank you so much for this award. I really, really appreciate it. Um, I just would like to thank the whole dietetics department and the lecturers because this degree is extremely challenging and they never fail to motivate all of us. And thank you so much to the sponsor for this award. Thank you, Courtney. And I'm, and I'm certain every our, our award recipient here will say their degree is quite challenging, but yeah, no, I understand what you mean by challenging in dietetics. Um, okay, moving forward. This is a Valley Trust Award for the best third year dietetics student, which is uh, awarded to Julia Stewart. Julia, any word of thanks or for the award? Good afternoon, everyone. I would just like to thank the college and Valley Trust for this award. I would also like to thank my lecturers for their continuous guidance and support. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I'm not sure if a Valley Trust person is here. Um, just give them a moment. No, I don't think so. Okay. So we're going to move forward to, again, with still with dietetics. And this one is sponsored by the Association for Dietetics in South Africa Award. And the award is for the best student in food service management internship, which is FSM T410. And the award is presented to Bache Nosmilo Mazibuko. Marcia, are you here? Yes, I'm here. Um, good afternoon, everyone. I'm really honored to be receiving this award. I would like to thank my lecturers, uh, my lecturers um, from the, the dietetics department. And also I would like to thank my mom and my sister for supporting me. And also lastly, I would like to thank God. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Marcia. And I think Laurentia wants to say a few words on behalf okay. of Edson. Hi everyone, um, as the current uh, chairperson of ATSA KZN, I'd just like to congratulate Barshley on her outstanding achievement. We wish you all the best for the rest of your community service year and your career as a dietitian. Well done. Thank you. Thank you, Laurentia, and thank you, Barshley. And the next award is sponsored by Nestle Nutrition Institute, and the award is called Net Nestle Institute sorry, Nestle Nutrition Institute Africa Award for the best student in community nutrition internship, which is Nutrition uh, 410. And the award is going to Sharante Reddy. Shar Sharante, are you here to accept the award? Yes, I'm here. I just wanna say a huge thank you to my family and friends for supporting me through this journey. Um, I'd also like to thank you, Gizaren, and the lecturers for guiding us and helping us to obtain our degree. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, Sharante. Uh, Sally, do we have anyone from Nestle? Okay, we can move forward. Yes, to yes. Uh, sorry, Chair, we do have uh, Lindy, who's, who's from Nestle. Okay. Lindy, please go ahead. Well, good afternoon, everybody. Thank you so much for inviting us. Uh, my goodness, dietetics was difficult 20 years ago. It continues to be difficult. And it is because it is a science. And um, Sharante, you are faced with challenges where everybody believes that by going to Dr. Google, they can diagnose and treat any nutritional challenges that is out there. So go out there. We have the faith in you. We trust and believe that while you're out there, you'll do everything that you can to manage the challenges that are facing this country in light of everything else, including economic and inequality in society. All the best, we wish you all the best, best of luck. Thank you so much. 
Thank you, Lindiwe, for those uh, words of um, appreciation and also thanks to the uh, our team. Uh, we're going to move. The next one is a Valley Trust Award for the best student in therapeutic uh, dietetics internship, which is Diet 410. And the award goes again to Sharante Reddy. Sharante, do you want to say something more? Uh, just a huge thank you again, especially previously to Nestle for the award and now for Valley Trust for the award. Thank you so much. Anyone from Valley Trust? Okay. Okay. Sally, I think we, we skipped one. Yes. Yeah, I think it's the yeah, it's the same sponsor, which is Nestle Nutrition Institute for the Nestle Institute Africa Award for Best Final Year Student in Dietetics. And the award, ladies and gentlemen, also goes to um, Sharon Reddy. Just one last time, a huge thank you for everyone, for everything. Thank you. <laughs> Are you sure it's the last one? I hope so. <laughs> there, must be, there might be another one coming. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you, Sharante. And moving forward. Is the award called A.R. Sanders Award? which is a DAX award for agricultural and dietetics program, which is uh, awarded to Ross Tarr. Ross, is Ross here? Thanks, Prof. Yes, yes. Prof. Amir, thanks. Uh, firstly, I'd just like to thank my family and friends for their constant motivation. Thanks to my mom for funding my studies. Um, secondly, thank you to all my lecturers for their support over the past few years. Thanks for answering my many emails. And then lastly, a big thank you to my supervisor, Prof Odundo, for his guidance and supervision. I'm not sure if he's here, but yeah, thanks. Okay, thank you, Ross. Um, that From my list, that seems like that was the, the last award of the evening. Um, but, um, let me we have... call that... Oh, Yes, go ahead, Sally. Uh, the Encarbo Biotech Awardee has arrived. If we can go back to that one. Yes, please. Okay. Uh, the recipient for that award was, I think it was Mtobi Simazibogo, mm. if I recall correctly. That's correct. Yes. Okay. So this award is called Ignabo Biotech Award for the best third year virology student in the module Introduction to Viruses, which is Plant Pathology 305. And the award is presented to Mtobi C. Mazibugo. Mtobi C., over to you if you have uh, some words of thanks. You're muted, Mtobi C. Yes. Go ahead. Uh, greetings, uh, Prof. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, I would like to, to thank my school uh, uh, for, 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 for having this program and also uh, my lecture for, for, for the award. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you, Mtobi C. Um, Sally, we, didn't have, we don't have anyone from Innova Biotechnology. Okay. Okay. I think that takes us then to the end of the list, but not to the end of the program. So I'd leave that, um, I'll, I'll hand over to you, Sally, to take over the program. Thanks very much, Prof Maguaza. Uh, so that is the end of the awards. Just to say, the the school will be in touch with all of you to give you your actual awards 
and if they're particular certificates or um, trophies. And in Tokozo from my office, we'll be in touch with you to give you all your certificates. So from my side, once again, well done. And we will share a recording of this um, evening that you can share with friends. So it just remains for me to please call on our DVC, Prof. Albert Modi, uh, to give the vote of thanks and say a few final words. Uh, Prof. Modi. Thank you once again, Sally and colleagues. Uh, congratulations on uh, putting together uh, such a wonderful program. Well, I wonder how many people have been overcome <laughs> by a feeling of nostalgia during this moment. It happens every year, but it touches many of us in many ways. Um, seeing many of the sponsors, uh, who are friends of UKZ and agriculture, people who are our alumni. Um, some of them are not the sponsors, but they are the people who made sure that these awards come to our university. I want to say thank you very much to all of you. Please continue to get us more awards. We have many, many more students uh, who deserved to get awards, but unfortunately it's a competition. So we had to give uh, the awards to those who came first. Uh, we wish we could give it to all of them. Uh, all of them deserve awards. Uh, we have been through difficult moments in the past two years. And I'd like to assure uh, those who got the awards and those who did not get awards that uh, success is not a failure and failure is not fatal. It is the courage to continue uh, what counts. And uh, those are the words of an old man called Winston Ch Churchill a long time ago, and they still resonate uh, with many of us. Colleagues, um, I would like again to um, encourage our lecturers to continue doing a good job. Uh, people don't know um, the good things that are happening in our college, in our schools, mainly because we don't share that information with them. And some of them uh, you believe that they know what is happening in the university and they suddenly um, give us very wrong information. We rely on the students and staff and the leadership of our college to defend our schools and colleges. We are doing very well. We can compete with anybody in this country and in the world. Uh, we are attracting relationships with stakeholders. And when we give them our students, we would like our students to perform as well as we tell them that they will perform. So I look forward to the students who got awards today to think very carefully about their future. Please come to us if you want to study for postgraduate qualifications, uh, ask for assistance. Um, please don't be shy to talk to us if you need advice about bursaries as well as uh, future directions in terms of your careers. We are here to answer your questions. Uh, please continue doing a very good job. Uh, I remember many of you asking me difficult questions in class and now you're receiving an award. Uh, so please continue to be like that, have a positive attitude. This is the University of KwaZulu Natal. Thank you very much. Well done. Thanks very much, Prof Modi. Uh, and that brings us to the end of this evening's ceremony. So once again, well done to all awardees, uh, to their families for supporting them, their friends for supporting them, their lecturers for getting them where they have got today. And enjoy your evening. And with that, we'll bring this evening to a close. Thanks, everyone, and goodbye. <laughs>